YouTube, what's up? Team Natty here. We're about to go to the gym, get swole, do some uh, some lifting. Got bench press today, so I'm excited. today we hit bench then we hit some side lateral raises and we hit some triceps and my rope got stolen halfway through the triceps so then I just had to grab onto the ball at the end of the cable but if you're really looking to get some good contraction on the triceps to really isolate them and get some great contraction and some mind muscle connection um, take the clip off or take a rope and then pull it all the way through so that you have a lot of length and just make sure you're not pushing or pulling your front delt, I'm gonna use this as a light. And you really wanna make sure that you're not pushing down or pulling with your front delt. You really want the, you wanna pull this back. I like to put my hand right there to hold it, make sure it's not going forward. And just completely contract and pull down with the tricep. And you will get a great pump, a good mind-muscle connection, and you'll really feel it working out. So, quick tip for you, you can do that with overhead and just straight pull down. Another thing I do, and you might see me do this, and you might think that's weird, because a lot of people when they're doing their side lateral raises, they'll make it seem like they're pouring a jug of water. In fact, when I was first introduced to the lift, that's what I was told to do, was to come up like that. Turn your pinky up. What that does is, is it internally rotates your shoulder and impinges it and it slams your rotator cuff with the shoulder joint. Why do I know this? Um, just. I've been told that several times. I've looked up on the internet. You can find it anywhere. But a great YouTube creator, a, just a great fitness uh, expert in general, Athlean X. I watch his videos um, quite frequently. Not as much as I used to, but he has got some great tips on there. Not just on how to work out and what workouts to do to build muscle, especially if you're natural or you want to be more athletic and like you just want to perform better in your sport. But things to do safely so that you're not hurting yourself so you're not setting up for a long-term injury now my my dad my uncle like lots of people I know have had shoulder tears they've had rotator cuff rotator cuff tears they've had problems with their shoulders that's something I definitely do not want to get into I want to be able to throw a ball with my kid I want when I have one that is I want to be able to you know do things for a long while and I don't want to hurt my shoulders because that is like such a huge crucial part to your entire I mean upper body really is your shoulder so something I really look into is shoulder health and safety. You guys should too. So that is why you'll see me lean forward slightly, like I'll hip hinge forward and then I'll come up with my thumb up as to create external rotation and still hit that medial deltoid. So like you wanna hit this side delt, you wanna get that boulder look, you wanna get that three dimensional shoulder, that little pop, you know, like you see the Dragon Ball Z characters have. And you wanna lean forward slightly and then come up with your thumb. That way you have external rotation, keeps your rotator cuff safe and free, and you can still hit it. So, look it up, Athlean X, great YouTuber. And I'm sorry the lighting's so bad, it's like raining and my camera's out of focus, so I do apologize. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. You guys, take it easy, stay natty, Team Natty out.